Hi, my name is Nikima Prophet. I'm a developer advocate at PayPal. In this video, I'll walk through a standard integration by following the steps in the onboarding banner found on the developer dashboard. On the first step, we're asked, which payment solution do you want to offer? In this case, we're choosing the standard checkout, so let's go ahead and click that selection. Now we're shown resources to help us integrate. I'm going with the integration builder for this example, but there are also links to the developer documentation and video tutorials. On the integration builder page, I'm leaving the default option selected and scrolling down to download the code in step three. Once that's downloaded, I'll open the sample app in my code editor. Let's take a look at the test credentials in the app. In this case, it's in the index.js file. We have a client ID and an app secret. We're going to need to replace these test credentials with our actual app credentials. So let's go back to the developer dashboard for this next step. We have the integration ready to go. So let's click the button that says next add sandbox credentials. We'll copy these and paste them into the code editor. Now that the app credentials are filled in, we can test the integration. Let's click next make test payment to move on to the next step. On this step, we can choose from different test payment scenarios. Let's do PayPal for this integration. I'll need to copy the email address and password and log in with this buyer's account. Here's our test transaction. I'm gonna go ahead and complete the purchase. And the transaction was completed. To see this test payment and all Sandbox transactions, we can log in to sandbox.paypal.com with the business account email associated with the application. The recent activity shows a test payment of two cents that we just made to our Sandbox account. That was a step-by-step -step standard checkout integration using Sandbox credentials and integration builder. With the business account, in the next step, you'd be shown the credentials for a live integration.